you guys, it's Griffin and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am doing a huge try on haul because I just recently got a ton of PR packages and a lot of them are closed. So I wanted to share them with you guys and let you know my opinions on them. None of this is sponsored. I just want to show you guys literally like what I've been receiving in the mail and if I genuinely like it or not. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first brand that I received stuff from is Zaffle and I literally have a huge bag right here full of Zaffle. So Let's get into it. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, Zaffle is a wholesale website and it really doesn't have like huge expensive brands on there and it just shows you really cute clothes that are freaking adorable and they're super inexpensive. So part of you is wondering, is it worth it? Is it gonna be worth the hype? Am I gonna get product? Is it gonna look like the picture? That's what my biggest concern is. So right here, I will insert the picture of this velvet two piece that I'm about to try on. Right now I have it in front of me and quite honestly, it's not bad. Let's get it on and see what we think. Okay. I really like this set. Overall, I really, really like this. It's nice. It's well fitting. It feels really smooth and soft. It's not irritating my skin and it's perfect for a picture, like I really like it. So next up is another two-piece set from Zaffle. I've noticed that these are really popular on Zaffle. I like know that these are really popular outfits, but I noticed a lot of two pieces on there. So this is just a white little hoodie and it has these sleeves with roses and floral pattern on them. And then it came with just a simple pair of white shorts. Nothing to them, they're very simple, but let's try these on and see what we think. I'm wearing black underwear and I feel like you can definitely see them through it. This is super cute. I really like this. The one complaint I have about this is that the shorts aren't sewn together so technically it's like it can do that. I'm just showing you guys that for the purpose of they're like that and I wanted to tell you guys. But, but this is a really cute set and again it looks just like the picture and I'm really impressed by this. I really like it. The only thing is that this like little floral piece is falling off a teensy little bit and then this is just like open. That doesn't really bother me that much because the fabric isn't gonna like fly open like how I'm showing you guys but I think this is really the biggest part of it and I have a sewing kit in the other room So probably when I'm done with this video, I'll just sew it back on and then it'll be a 10 out of 10 All right, I have another two-piece. I promise I'm not crazy I just really love the two pieces that they have this one I actually saw my friend Clarissa wearing it and I fell in love with it And I was like, where'd you get it from and that same day? I picked it out because I was like, I love it So Clarissa shout out to you. I have these pants that are flare bell bottomy velvet leggings with two white stripes going up the side and then it has a matching little bralette with no straps and it has two white stripes going up the side as well. First off, these pants fit extremely well. Like, I feel like not only do they make my butt look really good, it's just like extremely nice fit and it's like tight around the waist where you want it to be and it's not giving me like a camel toe or anything which is my biggest like thing I'm nervous about when it comes to like cheaper clothes. Um, so I'm really impressed with the pants so far but let's get that top on. Wow. This is the cutest set. I am obsessed with this. This already has a 10 out of 10. Like, I don't even think I need to say anything else about it. It's so cute. I love it. I almost like want to go get like eight more in like different colors. I don't even think that they have other colors of this, but if they did, I would get the other colors. Next is just a comfy little sweater, which we are going to throw on with this because it has green. The green isn't necessarily the same exact green, but I also don't know what else I would wear this with out of all the stuff that I'm trying on. So I'm just gonna put it on with this and yeah. This is a black and green little cropped jacket. Actually it looks really cute with this. I like it. On the back it has like a little cat saying going home. And then on the front it has this writing right here, but I can't really tell what that says. It has like a little like circular zipper, which I think those are really cute. Big fan. I'll probably wear it more. Ooh, and it has like these little like, I wonder what that does. Oh, that draws strings the bottom together. Does that have it? Yes, it does. <gasps> Oh, so you can have it as like a tight crop. Ooh, I like that. I literally have been waiting to wear all of these clothes, so I'm gonna be wearing the cutest clothes for the next couple of weeks, and I'm so excited about it. Okay, so next is this <laughs> two-piece set. You guys are gonna see a lot of these. It has this cute velvet top and these cute velvety high-waisted bottoms. They have a little lace trim. I will show you guys close up. It's super cute, and I'm excited to get these on and see what they look like. That's a little like lace detail, and this is the little bralette. I think the bralette's super cute for like any occasion which is what I really like about it. I'm a little nervous about these bottoms because they feel so thick, like the waistband feels so thick that I feel like it'll almost look like it's puffing out a little bit, but we'll see. So I have it on and I was kind of right about the bottoms. It's not that they're thick. It's just like, I feel like there's too much material on the side. If they wanted to like kind of go for like that high-waisted underwear look, they would go like up like that and it would kind of go a little bit more 
of a scoop right here. But overall, I really like these and I feel like it's perfect for this other two-piece set, which I'll show you guys right now. So I'm going to pair it with this two-piece set. These are mesh black shorts that have these little embroidered rose patterns on them. And then this is the top. Honestly, I'm so obsessed with the top and everything. I feel like this will look really good together. And I feel like this is a nice set to wear underneath it. It might not be like good for by itself, but I feel like it'll look really good together. These are really long strings. I get it though. We like bows. I like this. I'm so into it. This top is a little bit short. It doesn't actually cover this bra all the way, but I can always just like pull the bra up a little bit and then pull the top down a little bit and that way it does. I like this a lot. I feel like it's super cute together. I think I will find myself wearing this top quite a bit. Okay, so now I'm changing into another two-piece set. This one is a wine red lacy bralette. It kind of reminds me of Gooseberry. And then these little bottoms that are like silky and have a little bit of floral trim at the end here. These definitely look like something that you would find on a lot of different sites. Like you would find these on Boohoo. You could find something like this on Topshop. You could find something like this at Victoria's Secret. There are so many places to find things like this. I'll put the actual price of it right here because I don't have it with me. I really just love that you can get a look of these more expensive places for a cheaper price. So let's keep going. I really like the top and I think I would like the bottoms if they were a little bit shorter. Personally, these don't fit me that well. They're a little big around the waist and I feel like they're kind of long. And there's also like a little bit of tightness in the back and I don't know if it's like what is going on with it because it's like they're kind of big in the front but then in the back they're too tight. And then this drawstring I thought would fix the too big in the front problem but it's not a real drawstring so it doesn't actually like tighten anything. And, and I'm going to switch out of it into a swimsuit because that is my final two piece from Zaffle. <laughs> so next is this gingham suit. I actually don't even know if it's gingham. I think it's just like a checkered black and white pattern. It's actually really cute and I like the bottoms because they have like a V cut so it kind of naturally makes it look like you have like that V line that everyone wants. And I like the back because I like my bottoms to be on the cheekier side. I wish I got a size up because it's kind of either giving me a wedgie or rolling in like it's not really fitting 100% perfect but that's my own fault for getting a wrong size. And then this top honestly I'm just scared my boobs are gonna fall out but I really like it. Overall I think that this would be really cute for a picture and I think it would look super fitting on like anyone. However it just scares me so much to have my boobs like right here and like so easily able to like just come out so let's get switched into the next thing. Okay so next is this gingham dress and I love this. I literally saw like the same exact dress at Brandy Melville for like 40 bucks and this one let's see if it has a price. It doesn't have the price on the tag. This one's less expensive and it's also like a little bit stretchy so if you're gonna have a big meal you know you can stretch a little bit. Um, also I just think that overall it's a really nice fit. I feel good in it. Nothing else needs to be said about this. It's an awesome dress. Oh no don't hate me. I forgot about my last two piece outfit but this is just a black bikini. I'm gonna put it on because it's kind of hard to like show it what it looks like just because it's a bikini. Oh my god this is so cute. I love this. This totally reminds me of like a swimsuit that you would just find at the mall or you would see like an Instagram model wearing. Like it's so freaking cute. I love high-waisted stuff because it just makes you feel a lot more confident and I especially love high-waisted because it hides my little cookie pouch that I keep right here. <laughs> okay let's try on some tops. Wow okay I'm covering my boobs because my nipples show right through this. You definitely have to get like little patches. I think that this is super cute. It honestly reminds me of like the top from Saved by the Bell, that like one picture. I'll insert it right here, the top that it reminds me of. I think it's super cute and I definitely like it. I would just have to wear either a bra or little stickers under it. Okay, so this is the next top. I love this. When I saw this top, I got really excited because they have it in the same color that I have it in, which is like this seafoam green. And I wanted to get it to see if it was as good of quality as the top that I already owned. So I got this in white and black. I will show the black one on camera. I'm not going to try this one on because it's literally just the same thing. This is such a nice shirt. It's so cute. I really like it. I might actually just end up wearing this tonight on my date because I think with the white it's just like a nice soft look and I think if I were to wear the black one it would look a little bit more edgy. Next are these little off the shoulder tops. I got this in red, 
white and black. Honestly, I really like this. I feel like it's just a super cute trend that I've seen everywhere and like I never really knew where to get this top. So it was cool when I found it on Zaffle and it was super inexpensive. The only thing that I definitely was not appreciative of with this top is that it was a one size fits all and this is not a one size fits all top. When I received it, I was like, is that even gonna fit me? And I'm a very small person. It's a little tight on my arms, but definitely I can deal with it. I honestly love all three colors. I'll do like a quick flash of me wearing all three. I think overall this is a really cute top and I will probably end up wearing it a lot. Okay, so the final piece I will be showing you guys today from Zapple is the yellow top. I find this the cutest out of everything because I feel like I will actually wear the living crap out of this top. I feel like it's really cute, it's cropped, and it has a nice cut. And I'm almost debating going back and getting the baby blue one because that one looked just as cute too. Zapple literally has so much stuff on their site that you could go on and be shopping for hours. It's like shopper's heaven. They have so much cute stuff. A lot of it is really nice quality and it doesn't feel bad whatsoever. I think people who are scared to give Zaffle a try definitely should because you get a lot of really good pieces. Like I think there were probably only about two things in all of the things that I got that I might not wear as much as the others, but I'm still gonna wear everything and it's really inexpensive and it feels like nice quality. Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. I lied. There's a pair of shorts from Zaffle that I didn't try. These are gonna be way too big and I can already feel it. This is just me and a sizing issue. Okay, this isn't me and a sizing issue. I have an issue with these. Not not only is there no buttonhole for the actual button, that is 100% not opening at all. There's no hole in there. But there's a second button, like this side goes higher than the other side, and there's no second buttonhole for it. You zip up, the first button should go there, then where's the second button go? And look how big these are. These are the smallest size. I am a size 25 or 24 in my waist usually, and these I think were a size small. Hey guys, I'm currently editing this video right now and I totally realized I forgot to mention something about Zaffle that I figured out after filming the video. What Zaffle does with denim is when you get them, you have to cut the hole yourself for the button to go through. And I didn't know that. I thought the buttons already came, like the cuts were already in the holes. So that's why these didn't have a cut. But it still does not explain how they were so messed up. <laughs> so I don't know. I think if they fit and they didn't have that button issue, they'd be really cute because I like this little patch on them. I may take the patch off and try to put it on a different pair of shorts or something. Okay, so now it's time to show you guys what I got from Honey Bum. I'm not gonna show you everything that I got from them, but I'm gonna show you some of my favorite pieces that I got from them. Okay, so this is look number one from Honey Bum. I really love this set. It feels like such good quality. I love the two red stripes going down the side. I love camo. I think it's the cutest, especially right now. I feel like it's a really big trend. And then it also gathers right here. So it's a little bit tighter here than everywhere else in the top. And then if you unzip it and just wear like a little black bralette with it, it's super cute. It makes my butt feel like it's looking bouncy and good. Like I've been living for this and I never want to change out of it. But I might to show you guys the next thing. Okay, next is this little mustard bomber jacket. How freaking cute is this? This is what I live for. Look at what it says on the back too. It says sweet like honey and then it has a little scrunch on the sleeve. I already wore this sweater to like a photo shoot and I got a ton of compliments on it. I really like it and it feels like such good quality. Like I'm probably gonna have to get more bomber jackets and more stuff from Honey Bomb because all their stuff feels like really nice quality. So my last item from Honey Bomb is this snake skirt. Let's put this on. I actually have a matching snake top that I got from a different company, but I wanted to see if it matched. So let's put this on, go grab the snake top and come back. Okay, it's so, so weird. I knew when I saw this online, it was like the same or if not a very similar pattern but they're very different textures like this is like a it feels almost like a swimsuit or like a workout gear type of texture and then this is a very cotton texture I'm not gonna put this on because it's not the exact same this skirt is a big hit for me but now it's time to move on to the next company which is gooseberry intimates first I'll be trying on this navy swimsuit the thing about gooseberry is that their swimwear and their intimates and everything is rather expensive but holy crap it's so worth it. Guys, I'm loving this. These are the bottoms. They fit extremely well. I don't feel like they're doing that weird thing where they like fold in right here. These fit really, really nice. And it's such a nice, soft, good material. This is the top. I actually really like this. Next, we're going to try on this brown taupe-ish color of the same style of suit. Um, it doesn't have like the same texture as it. It's very like a soft, plain pattern, but I will put this on and show you guys and let you know what I think. Okay, so like I understand both sides 
of the swimsuit spectrum of spending a ton of money and getting a suit that you really really love so like this suit I know is a little bit more expensive this is a swimsuit that if you got it you would love it so much and it would be like your go-to swimsuit but like I also understand buying a ton of really cute and expensive swimsuits so it's like I don't know which one I'd rather do I love it wow okay so next we are going to be getting into the actual intimates from gooseberry intimates instead of their seaside swimwear um, we are going to try on this white lace thong and this bralette that came with it. I'm not even kidding when I tell you guys they have the literal cutest lingerie. Like, if you want something cute that doesn't look like trashy, this is where you want to go. I swear this is the most ghetto thing. I'm taking a hygiene wrapper from my swimsuit and putting little things over my boobs so that I can show you guys. Oh my god! These are literally like, this is the only thing I ever want to wear. Like, huh. It just makes me feel really good about myself. It makes me feel confident, it makes me feel sexy, and it's really nice fabric, so it's super comfortable too. Like, a lot of lingerie that you get, especially if it's like cheap lingerie, is like, the fabric feels like plastic, and this is just like, you don't want to take it off, that's how comfy it is. Now, let's try this same thing on, but in black. I got it in both colors because their sets are just so beautiful that you have to get both of like everything. Like, you just cannot help it. I literally just don't even have words to describe to you how this makes me feel. These are the cutest sets I have ever seen. I'm going to say it once and once only. Gooseberry has the best stuff like ever. So if you want stuff from them, go check them out because they genuinely have really good stuff. I'm not being paid to say this. I just really love everything. Okay, now because there are still two more pieces for me to try on from Gooseberry, I'm going to try the last two on. This is basically like a one piece of what I'm wearing and then this other one is just a swimsuit. See, I love this because I feel like this is the perfect in-between of like if you want to wear something that's like a little bit lingerie then you can but then you can also just pair it with a nice cute pair of jeans a little belt and a hat or something and it would be the cutest outfit like of all time so I like this piece a lot because it's super versatile it can be used during like your own personal fun time and then it can also just be used during the day and then this is the final swimsuit piece see I feel like I want to go to Cancun right now and just lay by the beach because this feels like the perfect, like it's a nice deep dunk and it's like just super sleek and sexy and it makes you feel good and it makes you feel like you should be on like some exotic beach in the Bahamas or something. Like oh, everything about Gooseberry just makes me feel so confident in myself when I wear their stuff. So thank you Gooseberry for making awesome products that I love and other people love too. The next amount of stuff is from Goodbye Bread. They put a little note in my package. So let's see what it says. They said, hey gorgeous, hope you love everything and can't wait to see what you come up with. XOXO, Goodbye Bread loves ya. I'm really excited because I got some like funky cool stuff from there because their website is not the same as every other website. Like you can't find this stuff that I'm showing you guys on a lot of other websites because it's so unique. First up, your girl gonna be a mermaid. Sorry, I got a little excited. But like, your girl is literally gonna be a mermaid. I just lost a piece. I'm gonna be a mermaid, okay? <sighs> This is so cool! Wow, I don't think anything could beat this swimsuit. Holy crap, it's so cool. This is what the back looks like, and I will come show you guys a close-up of a little like scalloped seashell. It's so shiny and fun. I literally want to do a photo shoot in this swimsuit because then it would look super cool. It would literally look like I'm a mermaid, especially if someone edited a tail on me. This is happening. The next thing is from Trash Cosmetics, which I actually tried to find their Instagram, and their Instagram is private, and so I was like, what the heck? Can't even see anything, but they have like such cool hair gel. Hold on, I'm gonna open this close to you guys. Oh, do you see this magic? What? It's so cool, guys. This is so cool! I literally want to do like little space buns and then do some like glitter hair gel right here. And then the final thing that I'm going to show you from Goodbye Bread is a pair of shoes. I'm so excited to wear these. These are really cute. Like these have vulgar language on them, but they're really cute. So let's open this box however we can. I just need to bring these close up. That's all. Literally, what the actual 
Oh my gosh, I love them. So they're the cutest shoes I think I've ever seen. Just because they're so like, they're pink, they're girly, you wouldn't think that they would say the effort on them, you know? Oh my gosh, I don't know if I'm ever gonna take these shoes off, by the way. They're staying on. Next is a one-piece swimsuit from a company called Solid and Striped. They actually DM'd a stylist that I had worked with previously, and they reached out to see if they could send me a swimsuit. And I, of course, said yes. They have the cutest swimsuits. They have a lot of ones that have, like, cherries on them and stuff that are, like, black and white stripes. They're really cool. You have to check them out. But this is the swimsuit that I got, and so now let's try it on. Ooh, I like this. I never really wear, like, a muted blue color like this, but I think it looks really good. I really like this swimsuit. I think I would get a size up in the bottoms because they feel just a little tight right here. It feels like they're just pulling in on my skin, but that's just me. I got a wrong size. This feels like a, such a nice swimsuit that you'd be able to get a lot of use and a lot of wear out of. I want to wear it to the beach right now. Guys, literally, let me tell you. I just got this tanning oil that I've been wanting to use so bad, but the past two weeks in LA, the UV ray has not been above two, and you need it to be at least at like a four or a five to tan. Like, I don't know what to do. How am I supposed to even get tan right now? help. Okay, so now we have this final box from Zushu, and I'm super excited to open it up and see what's inside. I picked out a few different pairs of shoes, but I'm not exactly sure what pairs that they sent my way, so I'm really excited to take a look, and I'll let you guys know what I think. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, these are the most beautiful shoes I've ever seen. Literally, what? They smell like new shoe? I am in love with these. Guys, this has to be by far one of the coolest shoes I've ever seen. Holy crap, I love it. And they gave me two of them. That was a bad joke. Literally, I need to wear these like right now. Next are these little heels. I love these little like circular metal pieces. Like I've been seeing that a lot on like denim jackets and stuff lately and I've been loving it. These look really cute and really nice. Aw, I can totally see myself wearing these on a date or like just somewhere like a little event, something like, ooh, brunch. These would be perfect for brunch. Okay, another pair. Ooh, oh my God. Guys, do you see these? Like, these are such cute, like, little Oxford shoes. They look like, oh, I'm just so in love with these. Like, Zushu literally just has the best shoes. Also, they had emailed me, and we'd been talking a little bit back and forth, and they had asked if I'd be interested in doing a giveaway with them. If you guys want me to do a giveaway with them, I'm doing it for you guys, not for them, for you. Let me know if you guys want me to do a giveaway with Zushu, and I will try my best to work one out with them. Wow, I just love these, and I feel like they're perfect for, like, a lot of outfits because they have both brown and black black in them. So these black crushed velvet boots, I want to wear all these shoes right now at the exact same time and not not wear a pair. You know what I mean? Like I'm just so in love with all these shoes from Zushu. Holy moly, you guys have great shoes. They also had these in like a pale pink color, which was like really, really cute. And I think I'll definitely have to get those too. And I got these little black sandals. They're just super simple. I don't really have shoes that I can throw on and run outside. So I just wanted to get a super simple pair of shoes and these were them. I really like them. They have a different texture on this like black part right here. It's like a soft matte texture. I'll show you what I mean. It's just different from this leathery part. Oh, dude. I just feel like such a freaking lucky girl. Like these shoes are so beautiful and all these clothes and everything. Moral of the story is every single brand that I mentioned in this video, I love to the moon and back. Like Zaffle, love. Gooseberry Intimates, love. Solid and Striped, love. Zushu, loved. Honey Bomb, loved. Goodbye Bread, Loved. I literally loved all six brands that I mentioned in this video. So if you guys want to check out any of the items that, that I picked out and was showing you guys, then you can check out the links down below. I will literally go through and link every single individual item because I love all the stuff that I showed you guys and I can't wait to just like turn off the camera so I can just put it all on because it's just like, oh, it's so overwhelmingly beautiful. But um, that is it for this video. I quickly want to say thank you so, so much to all of these brands that sent me these products. I am in love with them and I hope you guys understand that I'm not trying to brag. I'm just showing you guys what I got because some of you guys have been asking for more hauls and stuff, so I just wanted to do more of them. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this. If you enjoyed, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe, and hopefully I will see you guys later. Bye!